Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scott Delicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling villainous. And today, Coach Outlet has been completely overtaken by the great Disney villains. Through wind and darkness, I summon thee. Speak! What wouldst thou know, my queen? But before we hop into today's Coach Outlet shop with me for the villain collection, if you guys love handbags, hauls, luxury, coach outlet, the whole lot of those, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoyed today's content, make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoyed today's video. And it helps with that pesky <coughs> YouTube Al Go Rhythm. All right. Testing voice modulator. Blast your vile woman! My father fucked Marlena Dietrichs. Let's start off by looking at the Disney X Coach City Tote Bag with signature canvas interior. And this one has the Evil Queen motif. $450, but right now it is well, in the video, it says 30% off, but currently, I do believe these have gone down to 40% off. So, that is always good. So, it's not going to be as expensive as shown in the video. But it looks very beautiful. The pebbled leather, very nice and supple. But you will notice that the sparkles are just glued down. And with a little bit of touching it, you can see that the glitter just kind of rubs off on your fingers. So you just have to be careful with the glitter rub off. <laughs> Other than that, the leather motifs look great and I look really good with the bag and the bag looks good with me. Bam. Totally fitting the evil queen look. <laughs> and this bag has the dwarves on the back. Here we got a silk scarf. This one says 138 originally. So 40% off, give or take. And it's wrapped around the Cruella de Vil 101 Dalmatian City Tote. And on this City Tote, as you can see, the 101 Dalmatians has the red glitter. It looks really cute. All of these tote bags are very nice and I really like the artwork on them. They're very nicely done. They don't look sloppy. And they look like they were, they had a lot of thought and time put into the designs. And here we got the City Tote with Ursula. Also $450. So all City Tote bags with the signature canvas interior and whatever villain motif or whatever villain, you know, it, it'll be the same price. And they're all very gorgeous. And there's also a slew of bag charms. This one's the Bad Girls Club bag charm. And it is $68. I believe they are like 20 to 40% off. And then beside it is the little heart with the trio of Maleficent, Ursula, and Cruella. Below that is the Evil Queen card case. Very beautiful card cases. I'm not going to lie. If I were to grab something from this collection... It would definitely be the little Maleficent one there. I really like Maleficent. And the purple, oh my God, the purple is so stunning. $108. So as of this filming in the video, I do believe these went down to 40% off as well. But in the video, they were 20% off. So it now is a good time to get them. <laughs> Here we got the box crossbody with Maleficent and her a beautiful uh, raven or crow, whatever it is. I honestly don't even know, but I will say I love the artwork for all of them. All of the box crossbodies have this really beautiful artwork and it doesn't feel like it would be like artwork that'll rub off. 
$398 originally. So as you can tell, this collection is on the very pricey side. A lot more expensive than the last Disney collection. But I will say, the chain piece for this strap was very heavy. Like, heavy for an outlet piece. And that just means that they're upgrading the quality where it needs to be upgraded. And that's a good sign. And each piece has their little leather bag tag. As well, each piece has their uh, coach patch on the inside. And each piece is stamped with the Disney collection symbol. Very pretty. I just like the gradient effect and how it looks like it's like dripping and it's very different. I like how they're finally doing something different with the Disney stuff because usually it's like the really boring stuff. Like I, I usually don't like the Disney stuff but I vibe with this collection because I am a villain at heart myself. And perfect timing for the Little Mermaid. As we do know, the Little Mermaid is coming out with a live action. So very fitting to see Ursula trying to take her over. Very beautiful purples and blacks. Love the artwork. Again, all the artwork on the box crossbodies are just so well done. They're all $3.98, so you don't have to worry about one being more expensive than the other. And I do believe online they have, like, other ones. There are some online exclusives. Now, this is debatably my favorite bag from the whole collection. This is debatably my favorite because I am a super geek nerd and I love dragons and castles and oh my god. And Maleficent is, like, my favorite. So the Maleficent dragon on, like, the... I think this is the court mini backpack. $378. So it is fairly expensive. Oh, I think it's the West backpack. Sorry. But that artwork is beautiful. And sadly, it's only on the backpacks and the shoe. Which makes me mad because if the box crossbody had a beautiful Maleficent dragon like artwork or something, like girl, come on. Imagine if they had artwork of like the dragon breathing fire and like it's like, I don't know man, like there's, oh, missed opportunity. Girl, I would have thrown them my money in a heartbeat, but alas, alas, here we are. But here we got the West Backpack with the evil queen and she's looking very fierce if you will we love the snow white evil queen would have been cool to see the really old one like the the evil queen the one that makes the poison apple like the witch that would have been cool to see that would have been cool to see see what i mean by a like missed opportunities maybe they're holding out but I think it would have been cool to have, like, more dragons and the evil witch queen. Like, that would have been really cool. These are still cool, though. Here we got, like, a black canvas. Just, like, a normal cotton canvas. Uh, like, zip wristlet clutch thing. There's also a signature canvas. And it comes with patches. $298, so it is quite a bit for, like, this little, like, pouchette thing. Here is a size comparison between the two, though. I will say, I do like the Poison Apple. The Poison Apple patch is really cute. Again, they could have even done more with the Poison Apple, but it's fine. I'll stop complaining. Maybe. <laughs> Here's the tote. 328 just a nice little canvas leather trim tote bag with a very strong button snap. As you can tell, I had a hard time. This thing was not letting me go. Like, it was just like, no. Maybe the evil queen had cursed this bag, but who knows. A nice close look at a coach patch. 
Disney X Coach. Very beautiful bags. Expensive, but beautiful. Let's be real. And here we have one of the men's crossbody bags. And again, I wish they would have stuck to more different themes. Like, I like the patchworks, but I feel like they did a lot with the patchwork. Got, like, the little Disney symbol at the back of the coach patch, or the coach tag, sorry. Again, I love the patches, but would have been nice to see more done with the Poison Apple, the Evil Witch, and possibly the Maleficent Dragon. Would have been cool. But we got the Mirror Mirror on the wall, who is the most evil of them all. Yes, it is the. It is the. It is the for $350. Yes. <laughs> Next up, we look at the Ursula sweatshirts. I really liked the Ursula sweatshirts. They were very well done. Though I will say, uh, the pictures on them kind of varied by piece. 198 bucks, not too bad for a coach top, I'm not gonna lie. And here we got those corner small wristlets, corner zip wristlet, sorry, and with the Cruella. I really love the pebble leather on these pieces, they were very soft. I have a couple of recent pebbled leather pieces from the coach outlet, and oh, they're very nice. And it's very comparable to like previous collections but slightly elevated, possibly a bit thicker. Very soft though, and I just love it. Here is the Ursula one, and Ursula has a pretty golden seashell with some of her eyeliner or uh, eyeshadow, I should say. Very pretty pieces. You just have to be careful with the sparkles because with the sparkles, they'll they'll rub off. And on this piece, it looks like there's like the leather trim or like the leather motif is coming off, but it's actually just a piece of glue. So you don't actually have to worry. It seems like these won't just rub off. These are actually like on there. They're actual leather. Now I'm sure with time, you might get some little rub off here and there, but for the most part, as long as you're not grabbing a piece with a lot of glitter, you should not worry about the rub off. Though by the looks of it, every piece does have some glitter. This piece here is the Ava Phone Crossbody. This has the patches and behind it, I do believe is the Evil Queen. Very nice, though it's very small. Like this isn't gonna fit much. And for the price, it, uh, should be a bit cheaper because three hundred dollars. Mm, let's be real, girl. For a foam crossbody, that's a lot of money. Even at forty percent off, that's that's like one hundred and seventy bucks. Oof. Though I will say, it looks sickening with my outfit. It looks sickening. Matches all the colors perfectly. And here's the Evil Queen, like I was talking about, and she comes in a really nice, beautiful pebbled leather. She's just looking all pissy there. We love a fierce, pissy queen. <laughs> we got the track belt bag for $398. This one comes with Ursula and the Poison Apple. Not a bad piece. Just unzip it for you so we get a nice little look on the inside. Roomy, and it comes with its coach patch. The canvas, like the signature canvas is beautiful and it's really nice to see coach just continue to go farther and farther with quality. Though it's making us cost a bit, but we love good quality bags. This backpack is $750. So during filming, this was 20% off. So that would have been like an 
absolute astronomical asking point, but at 40% off, like, I, it's a lot more understandable. And here we got some camera crossbody bags for $129. Not bad. Fifty percent off jewelry. All of the villains' jewelry was cute, though I will say it it wasn't as heavy as I would have liked it to be, if that makes sense. The apples, like the poison apples, didn't feel like there was enough weight. Like, yeah, they would have been great as, like, bag charms or something, but I don't know how well they would have held up long-term for jewelry. It would have been cool to see, like, a poison apple bag charm or, I don't know, something like that. That would have been cooler. But these are still really pretty. And in all honesty, if you're able to and... If you have the means to do so, it would be a good idea to remove, like, the poison apples and put it on, like, better jewelry because outlet jewelry just isn't that great, in my opinion, for, like, any brand. Let's be real. It's just, it, the gold and the silver, it just rubs off really easy. And here are all the prices. 128, 118, 98, and 128. Each Disney villain has its own little bag charm with the bear. This one here is Maleficent and she's looking really sickening. If I had to grab a bear bag charm out of this collection, it would be Maleficent, let's be real. And then here we got Ursula. These are all $98 with 20% off in the video, but now they are 40% off. They come with their Coach X Disney little metal tag. I do really like them. Speaking of really cool though, we got these like massive collectible teddy bears for each like Disney villain. This one's Ursula. Each one's six hundred and fifty dollars, twenty percent off. Very excellently made. I will not lie to you. I really enjoyed being able to see these in person because I was very curious. Sometimes the bears can be hit and miss, but these ones were really, really cool. And each one had a coach patch on the back. And it had its own, like, each one had a different, like, phrase on it. This one's inspired by Ursula. And beside Ursula, they had the long wallet. A lovely mess. Which is what this wallet will leave in your purse. <laughs> the glitter will get everywhere, I promise you. It's very pretty, though. It would have been better if they put, like, some sort of coating over the glitter, though, because it, without a coating, it's going to get, like, everywhere. And $367 for a long wallet, continental wallet, whatever, zip around, that is too, way too much money. Here we got the Evil Queen collectible massive bear very pretty as well. It has a nice little uh, glitter pendant charm thing. Take a look on the patch. The si sinister Disney villain Evil Queen. And beside it is the Evil Queen bag charms. I'd say the Evil Queen's uh, probably the most basic one of the bag bear bag charms. And if you love the Rowan Satchel, they got Ursula. They got Ursula on a Rowan Satchel style. And even though it is a whopping $398, bucks, it is a very beautiful. That pebbled leather was so beautifully soft. But again, there is a lot of glitter on her eyes, so you do have to be careful with the glitter.
there was so many different handbags and styles and designs like that's why this video is so long because there was just so much they released like everything in the kitchen sink girl including the kitchen sink and I really do like this bear. Again, it's Maleficent. Again, I like Maleficent the best. I just think she's just the coolest out of all of like the Disney characters and how she turns into a dragon to me is just really interesting. What is your favorite like Disney princess fairy tale and what's your favorite villain? For me, Sleeping Beauty is my favorite fairy tale and Maleficent the dragon is my favorite villain. Again, I really wish they did more with the dragon because girl, I would have bought something if like, if like the Dempsey carry all had like a very beautiful dragon artwork or something, that would have been dope. But here we got the Cruella, the Cruella Dempsey carry all. Cruella is looking very luxurious in her white fur coat. $478. Fairly expensive, but again, the upgraded pebbled leather, it, it makes up for the steep price increases, but still, still hard on the wallet. <laughs> but girl, I'm stomping out hard. I'm stomping out hard with this outfit. Me and Cruella are just enjoying the furs. Mine's not real, but... An evil queen would never wear faux fur. And here we got the Rowan Satchel, $428. This one's got the patches. It's got some hearts. Bad Girls Club, Evil Queen, Ursula. It would have been cool to see them do... A, pa a certain patchwork bag was more orientated towards a single queen instead of having Ursula and then evil queen and hearts. Because it comes off as like, I, I get it's supposed to be mix and match, but it, it would have been cooler to see a, uh, a certain set, you know? Signature hoodie, $350. I hate these sweaters, though. The dogs look like they've been, like, beaten. That one looks mortified. And, uh, girl, no. Jail. That one, oh my god. <laughs> that one looks like it's, like... Skin and belt. I don't know, ma'am. They ain't looking cute. <laughs> the dog looks mortified. And then this one looks like a burn victim. And like, this bitch right here. Maleficent looks gorgeous. But Cinderella? Girl. But here for 50% off, we got some Rowan satchels. One with the uh, fairy tale rose print. I actually really love this rose print. This rose print is delicious looking. It is pretty, it is beautiful. It acts as like a multifaceted print. It could be edgy, it could be pretty, it could be princessy, it could be evil. It could be whatever you want it to be and I like that. Here, though, we have the Clear Crossbody 25 and the Mini Josie Top Handle Crossbody. $229 for this little cell phone pouch is extortionate, in my opinion. Just my opinion. Like, that is just way too much money for that. This piece here is pretty. 40% off, I think it said. Was that correct? If, if I remember correctly. It's a gorgeous piece, but 
I think what I like best about it is the colors, like the color screen, the color schemes and the purple, the red, it's very pretty. 40% off is a lot better than $229 for like a cell phone pouch. That's for sure. And it for sure looks a bomb with my outfit. Girl, that is like my favorite coat this year, I'm just saying. And I do believe we are going to be closing off the video with some of the Claire crossbodies again. $450. You're literally better off buying the Claire crossbody compared to this mini cell phone pouch. There can be a hundred people in a room. Maybe there is right now. And 99 don't believe in you. But all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred, hundred people, a 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 hundred, 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 or a thousand, nine thousand, or nine hundred ninety nine. There can be a hundred people in the room, in the room, in the room, and ninety nine, ninety nine, ninety nine don't don't believe in you. There can be a hundred people in the room. Alrighty, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's special villains shop with me. There was a lot. There was a lot. Girl. You don't want to know how much footage I had for this. I just knocked over a bag. I'm sorry. Oops. Anyways, that's a, that's a sign for me to wrap it up. That is a sign for me to wrap it up. Lord, hear my prayer. Anyway. <laughs> If you guys did enjoy today's content, please hit that subscribe button if you are new. Hit that like button, share with your friends and family, and comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's outfit of the day, video, and what is your favorite piece? Because girl, there's too many that I like. There are, there's a lot of pieces that are really pretty. As well, if you'd like to, you can always support me and my channel directly by sending me a very generous super thanks donation. And you can check out the description box below for the three lucky links to my Instagram, Facebook, and Discord notification squad. I love you all to the absolute moon and back. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye! <laughs> I think it was good. I don't, I don't. I'm done. I'm done. No, no, show's over. <laughs> show's over. <laughs>